Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Daddy Chain here again. Today, I'm going to show y'all how to put your cryptos onto your Ledger now or your cold wallet. Let's get it. Uh, the first step you do is go on their official website. Don't buy this from anywhere else. Right, go to their products. Now, no access. You could use Bluetooth. We can just get this one. You can choose the item as an individual or a business. PayPal, BitPay, or a credit card. When you get the delivery, make sure it's completely sealed, that it hasn't been opened yet. If it has been opened, return it. First step, we open the shit. Get your uh, recovery phrase paper ready. Go to ledger.com slash start. Download the app. I got a Mac, so I use a Mac. Plug your cord in the computer. Then you plug this side into your ledger. Then they'll say, welcome to Ledger Nano S. You see those top buttons? Right, left to navigate. You press both buttons at the same time to validate. Right, go to the start, and then they'll tell you to set a pin code. And then the pin code, right is up, left is down. And once you chose that number, you just press both of the button and go to the next pin number. You can either choose four pin numbers or eight pin numbers on there. Once you got all four or all eight, it'll say confirm pin code. Then you just press those both buttons and do the code again. Once once your pin code is confirmed, it'll tell you to write down your recovery phrase. You know, you go to the next one. So you just go to word one, write it down, press the next one, you'll go to word two, write it down, next one, go to word three, write it down. After it's all done, if you want to go back and check, just press left to verify all your words. If you're sure, just press right to go to the next stage. You want to press the two buttons at the same time. When it says confirm word one, it's going to have a word, but that's not going to be your word. So you just press the left button until it's the right word for your word one. When you press two buttons and confirm the first word, you do the same for word two. You keep on pressing the left button until you find the right word for the second one and then you click both of the button and confirm the second one and then you do that 24 times once you're done that 24 times you'll say the 24 words are your only backup so don't lose that paper that you wrote your words on i got it on another papers don't lose this do not share them with anyone once you get to the next stage, same thing, press both buttons to continue. After you press that, it's processing right now. And then after you process, it'll say your device is not ready. So as always, go on to the next step, press both buttons. First page will say set in the second page, tell you to install app. Ledger.com slash start, download it, install the shit, get started. Read the terms of views, accept the terms, enter Ledger app. Uh, asking you which device you buy, so we got Nano S, so we we'll press this one. This is for one, maybe you lost some shit, you got to recover, so we'll go to this one for the new one. Let's get it. Now the computer tells you the same thing that we did on the ledger. So this part we already done, okay, I'm ready. Next step, next step on everything. This part tells you very important here too, to hide your recovery phrase. Oh, okay, I'm done. Now it's game on. First question is asking if our crypto is stored on our nano or the blockchain. This is the blockchain, so next one. If required phrase is no longer secure or private, it's going to be this one. It's no longer safe. When I connect my Nano to Ledger app, my private key still offline. Next question. Uh, yeah, once you get all the questions, just keep next steps, next step on everything. Last part. It's going to check to see if your Ledger Nano was bought from their official website. And it's going to confirm that it's not compromised and everything. Press it. When it gets to this part, go back to your device. It'll say allow Ledger Manager, and you just press both buttons again. Say all good, your Ledger Nano S is genuine and ready to use with Ledger Live. Just press continue. So, you notice here you can't send or receive yet because you need to add a count. And you choose your wallet. Now, let's do Bitcoin first. Continue. You open Manager. We install Bitcoin. This app installed successfully. You can now add to your Bitcoin account. Right here. Device. Confirm the shit with double button. It'll say application is ready. Now back on the computer. It'll say synchronizing right now. I just usually just choose this one. It's like cheaper fees and shit. Wait, add account. That's it. Confirmation. Done. Now if you want to add another account for Ethereum, go to manager again. Oh, yeah. Install the Ethereum one here too. Install it, and your device will be saying processing also. Once it's installed, you see, now you see you got Ethereum 1 on here too. And then go back on the computer, manage my account, and same step. Now we go back to our device, press the two buttons. Now I'm doing the same thing, right here, add account successfully done. You know, you can send and receive money. Here, if you got money in here, you can send your money onto the exchange and all that stuff too. You go to top, 
like for me canadian dollars right here so i do that for my setting you want to receive shit onto your ledger then you go on your you know either your coinbase your binance you want to receive money device I'll click both of here you copy and paste this by clicking this right here now for this you want to verify it's the same address that's on here as the same one on your ledger yeah you'll have three pages you verify the thing go to the next page you'll have approve or reject you know if it's verified you approve it make sure man make sure this is the same as the address on your receiving part make sure it's the same if you want proof the same shit you press uh both of these buttons it'll say address share securely go to your binance or your coinbase if you want to send your bitcoin from your coinbase onto your ledger you go to your wallet you want to paste that address you copy from your ledger and then you just send whatever amount you want to send so let's do a test i just sent like 200 bucks let's wait like 20 minutes or something all right so the test was successful we got the 200 bucks sent to our accounts in our ledger so that's it man very easy to use so if you want to throw in bigger amount do a testing first on your new ledger and if it works then you can start sending bigger amounts onto your cold wallet all right that's it for today man it's your boy daddy chang i'll see y'all next time peace out